General Superintendent Reverend David Graves, National Director Ian Fitzpatrick, District Superintendent Reverend Gordon McCann, delegates and friends in Christ. This past year has been filled with unimaginable challenges. So the scriptures that have helped to form me are these. By my God, I can run through a troop and leap over a wall. The words of Jeremiah, Ah, oh, Lord God, there is nothing impossible with you. And one of my favorites right now are these words from David. I'd rather be a doorkeeper in the house of my God. Called to be his even at a young age, his transforming love allowed me to grow in his kingdom, opening my eyes to see his passion and compassion for those who had not yet met him. His compassion has increased my opportunities to inspire and motivate others to reach out in unexpected ways. Being a conduit on the one arm, reaching out to Canadian individuals, Christian and non-Christian, and with the other, touching lives around the world with the love of Jesus Christ. Following him has revealed unexpected occasions for service. I can say I have never been bored. Scared? Oh, yes. But what an adventure. Amazingly, the Lord placed me front and center in the middle of this pandemic, serving those who are health care workers, helping to care for one of our most vulnerable groups of people, our seniors. No one was more, more surprised than I to become an essential worker or a doorkeeper. Caring for a minimum of 200 people, including the frontline essential workers, management team, the residents, their family and friends. My title, a COVID screener. No one gets into the building or out of it without my permission. Isn't it just like Jesus to defy all the declarations by our society who proclaim the church is closed, his kingdom defeated and failing? Can you hear his response? An undercover chaplain placed by the hand of the Lord. This is his compassion in action. The daily adventure is to offer a listening heart, words of hope, prayer, or humor to those who are filled with fear, exhaustion, stress, and hopelessness, offering the heart of our Savior. Despite COVID restrictions, the Lord is causing His people, the Church of Canada Pacific District, to believe the Lord for the impossible. There are stories worth celebrating, stories of service and sacrifice by the people of Jesus Christ who are seeing closed doors opened and leaping over walls of unbelief. Some of these stories of sacrifice and service will be celebrated in my report at the District Missions Convention, respectfully submitted. <laughs>